and welcome back. So today I'm doing a what's in my bag video. I thought I haven't done one of these in a while and I wanted to do a very special Christmas festive limited edition. It's not really limited edition, but you know, a festive version. Um, I bought myself a little Christmas present and I thought I wanted to show it to you all. It is a handbag and I'm obsessed with it. So I thought why not do a little what's in my bag. This is the bag in question. It is from LK Bennett and it is this beautiful kind of rose gold champagne colour. And I feel like it's the acceptable kind of pink. You know sometimes when pink is a little bit too much and rose gold is a little bit too metallic? I feel like this is just on the edge and I really, really love it. I also really love the design of this bag because it's small but it still fits quite a lot of stuff in it and it has a really long strap so you can actually adjust the strap quite a lot as well. But it's really long and really skinny. I feel like this bag was what I kind of wanted the YSL blogger bag to be. Whereas the YSL blogger, bla blogger, bear, bo blogger bag, you can barely fit anything in. You can actually fit a lot of stuff in here. So I'm gonna show you what is in my bag. And if you wanna know where or if you want a link to this, I'll pop a link below because it's very cute. And when I was buying it in the shop, they were literally selling out. The woman was like, you are so lucky to get this. It's the last one. They've been selling like hotcakes. The girl next to me was buying one. I feel like they're a thing right now. Um, so yeah, it has two main sections. Um, they're both zipped. This front one has two zips though, which I quite like, because then it has this really cute like little dangly bit. And the zip is normally easy to open, but I have stuffed this bag so full because I've been shopping today. And the first thing I have are my keys. This is actually a combination of two keys. I have my home front door key clipped on, and this is on a key ring, which is from Mulberry, uh, which I've had for nearly 10 years. This is a miniature Dachshund key ring. And I got this way, 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 way before getting Piglet was even a question. And I did not know I would one day have a miniature Dachshund, but I've always loved them. And now I've started using it again because Obviously, I have a little piglet and it reminds me of her. So that is my front door key from home. And then I also have my keys for London, which is where I am right now. Um, and I have those on a Anya Hindmarch key ring, which I've had for quite a long time now. I actually got this as a gift from Mike's mum. And it's really cool because it's um, little dice with letters on either side. And you can basically like twist it to make up your own words. But when you have it the correct way, it says Anya love bags luck. And it has a little gold tassel on the bottom it's super cute and what I really like about this is it has the normal like key ring attached with the keys on but then it has the clip so what you can do is clip it onto your other keys for example so then I just have one set of keys for everything so those are my keys and then I actually have two wallets in here okay so my theory of getting a card holder and therefore having a small wallet is great but actually I end up having two because I have one for all my other stuff. So in this one, this one's the YSL Chevron card holder, which I adore, it's my fave. I have my credit card, two debit cards, and then my driving license. And then I've stuffed a load of receipts in the middle as well. I love this little card holder, it's so useful and it's the best color. Such a nice, like, beautiful kind of nudie beige pink. And then I also have this little one from Balenciaga, which I got last Christmas. And I hadn't used it that much until I got my YSL card holder. And now I have this as like a secondary wallet because if I have a bag that's too small to fit it in, it doesn't really matter. But I do quite like to take it around with me because it has all of my store cards in here as well as like stamps. So to go through here, I've got um, six first, fleur, 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 first class stamps. I mean, first class stamps. Actually, there's only two left, but they're purple and metallic. How cool is that? I think they're special um, anniversary ones with Queenie on here. Looks a picture of her and it says happy and glorious. Gotta love it. I've got my Space NK card. I've got um, a J. Crew store card, which I signed up for, for today because I spent too much money in J. Crew. I've got a VIP treatment card from Elizabeth Arden, which they gave me, which means I get free facials. Amazing. I've got a Jaeger card. I've got a My Waitrose card. Gotta get your free coffee in there. Heathrow Rewards card, which doesn't get used that often to be honest, but um, again, I bought my watch in Heathrow um, about six months ago and they're like, set this up and you'll get like however much money back. So I did and then I've never used it. Got an Oyster card, I've got my BA, I've got two BA frequent flyer cards and then I've got a Balthazar gift card, which still has 40 pounds on it and I haven't used. I have a Harrods card, I feel like I have all the store cards and a Boots card. So that is what is in my little, wallet and this one is slightly different as well and it works really well for having 
um, lots of store cards because it's like slightly open. It has like a constantine inside so you can fit more stuff in it. So it's good for like receipts and things like that as well. These bags do have like a little wallet section. So if you do want to put any cards in there, they have space for three cards. But that's all I have in the front section. Then they have like a little popper bit in the front as well, which I actually have receipts in and a, um, a gift card for Topshop when I took something back. And then yeah, there's just like that little bit. So you can put like receipts or letters or whatever in there. And then in the back section, this is when it gets good. And what I like about this bag is it's small and square, but it's not stiff. So it actually has like quantity inside so you can open it up and actually get in there. Whereas a lot of bags like this kind of shape, they're like really stiff and hard to get your hand in and you can't really see what's in, whereas this you can actually see what's in it. So let's see what is in it. I actually have my portable charger, which comes everywhere with me. This one, I don't know the brand because it just says Kiehl's on it because Kiehl's gave this to me when we went to Coachella. Um, but it has 5,200 milliamps or whatever that MAH thing is. Basically it charges your phone like three or four times, like my favorite one, it's still fairly compact. And then I have my cable for my phone because I always run out of battery because I use my phone way too much. I then have my vlogging camera. This is actually quite chunky, like I can't believe it actually fits in here with all that other stuff. Because I'm doing vlogmas right now, I might just do a little vlog. I'm filming my what's in my bag video right now. And this is gonna be actually on the video whilst I'm filming. So yep, just thought I would update you. That is all for now. So yeah, I'm doing Vlogmas. If you're not following me on Vlogmas, then go and check it out to see what I'm doing every day. If you don't want to know, that's fair enough because I'm a bit weird and you probably don't want to watch that. Um, anyway, and then I have some makeup in here and what have I got? First of all, I've got a Lancome Juicy Shaker and this is in the best colour. It's called Piece of Cake. It is by far the best colour that they make. It was one of the later editions. So they started off with like 25 colours and then they added this, which is the best colour ever. And it tastes like cake. I might put some on now actually, because it's really, really nice. Um, love it, absolutely love it. Um, so I've got that in there, that's like my fave. And then I have a concealer. I've got the Estee Lauder Double Wear uh, Liquid Concealer in Warm Light, which is actually a little bit too light for me right now. But um, yeah, it's in there, it's good for your under your eyes because it's a bit light. And then I have on the eyeliner that I'm wearing today, which is the Silk, or the Tarte Silk Amazonian Clay Eyeliner, which is really good. It stays on forever. Um, so that's what I'm wearing today. And I also have a lip balm because I have had the worst dry skin, dry lips, dry scalp, dry hands. Everything's just been so dry. I have my favorite lip balm. This is like OTT overindulgent lip balm. It's the Creme de la Mer one, but it's, freaking amazing, like it's the best lip balm in the world. I love it. And it lasts forever because I use like a tiny bit every time because it's so precious. It's like, no oh, precious. Like Gollum, yeah, that's it. That's my lip balm. And that is it for my bag. I hope you guys like my little bag. Merry Christmas to myself. Bit of a naughty purchase, but I'm slightly obsessed with it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see more and if you're not already watching my daily vlogs, then head over to my vlog channel where I'm vlogging every single day. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.